Hi everybody, welcome to World Swamp. This is Fat Frog, and today we're going to talk about sleeping bags, beds, and bunk beds in Ark Survival Evolved. And I'm here in my farmhouse because we've got two of those examples. We have the simple bed and the bunk bed. And uh, in a second, we will also have a sleeping bag. Now, a sleeping bag is nice compared to these other two because it can be put anywhere. It can be put on a foundation or it can be put on the ground. It's an inexpensive uh, temporary uh, spawn point. And that's why you make beds other than they look cool and they're spawn points. And I'm not going to place one in here. I'll save it for another time. So a sleeping bag is good because you can get it uh, when you're level five. You can put it outside caves or other places that you expect to die, but you want to respawn uh, really nearby and you can make several of them. The big downfall of the sleeping bag is that it is... Um, only good for one use so if you think you might die more often um, if you're playing single player like I am it's just kind of probably just better to build a thatch foundation and throw a bed on it or a couple of beds now beds have a cooldown time and that's why most people will just stack beds so here's a bed and you can place one bed on top of another pretty much um, I think there's actually two beds here yeah I'm pretty sure I put two beds here but it looks like there's just one because they're on top of each other um, then you can name the bed so you can rename the bed to whatever you want so you can keep track of it and then when you die you can respawn at whatever bed on the map that you have now this is a bunk bed and the uh, benefit of the bunk bed is that you respawn faster so your respawn time uh, can be half and you need to make a bunk bed over in the fabricator and so we can just take a quick look and see what it takes to manufacture one of these they're relatively expensive compared to a uh, sleeping bag or even a primitive bed isn't very expensive you'll need 80 polymer you will need 200 pelt hair or wood wool excuse me and you will need 320 metal ingots which is a lot you'll need 280 fiber and 120 hide so a lot of metal ingots for that um, for this silly bed it looks cool but it's expensive and I wouldn't necessarily recommend uh, building one just build a bunch of regular primitive beds it's much cheaper um, although it does look kind of cool here in the farmhouse so that's pretty much all there is to know about beds. You can glitch right into them <laughs> and glitch right out. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.